Jacksonville, and that's where Christine Scarpelli is, along with photographer Ryan. Hi, Christine. Although, guys, you'd think we were in Hawaii. I mean, this is just fantastic. Or, hey, how about the Caribbean? Maybe that would yeah. make sense this morning. All right, let me introduce oh, my go. guests. Lou, Lou Behave. We've got Lou here this <laughs> morning. We've got Councilwoman, which I love your name, Houlihan. Very good yeah. to have you. Of course, Mayor Curtis. We're glad yeah. to have her. Lisa, this morning, thank you for joining us. Yeah. All here to tell us about the Caribbean Chillers concert. It's happening on Saturday. Lou, what is this thing called? Raise the roof. Raise the roof. You know they'll be doing plenty of that. But this is a very important concert. We've got some video now. You're looking at this. These are the Caribbean Chillers. They're out of Florida, but they are coming here to Simpsonville, and they're excited about it because we are raising money. Important because we need a roof somewhere, right? We need a roof over our Tater Shed Amphitheater. That is the amphitheater that's here in our uh, downtown area. And we're just wanting to make sure everyone gets familiar with our arts complex that we're hoping to get off the ground this summer. Awesome. I love that it's in that city park area. Yes. It can really turn into an arts kind of district over there. Yes. Lou, tell me, what is this event going to look like? We're, it's going to look like a Jimmy Buffett concert. Whoa. <laughs> we're going to have a tiki bar, Margaritaville. We're going to have cheeseburgers in paradise, food trucks. All the music you can think of from Jimmy Buffett for four hours. Oh my goodness! All right. Okay. When does it start? It's st gates open at five on Saturday, which is tomorrow, and the concert actually starts at six, and we'll be there until ten. Oh my goodness! I don't know. You might have to kick people out. I think Fred, <laughs> the way Fred and Tracy were talking about it, I think we might be there until the next hometown spotlight, yeah. in which we may do in Simpsonville again because <laughs> yeah. we will still be here. Is this an important event for you guys? Just something fun for the city? It is. It's important because not only is it a fun, family-friendly event for us all to get together, but it's important for us in terms of maximizing the usage of our downtown spaces and growing our downtown area. Well, that is. It sounds like a goal. You know, you guys really do have everything. We're here at the ice cream station. These guys are just making some outstanding ice cream sundaes first thing. But really, guys, mission control. You've got a lot right here downtown. We do. We have a lot going on during the month of May. We have the Caribbean Chillers tomorrow night. Tonight, we have Sippin' in Simpson. We have the um, fair at Heritage Park that opens this month on the 18th. Right. We are just we are just a happening scene for May. Big deal. What do you think, yes. Fred Tracy? Happening or what? It sounds like it's going to be a Livingston Saturday night. If you're a Buffett That's fan, right. you get there you that. go. By the way, tailgating oh. for Buffett, we got to start like more like 5 a.m. Christine. Yeah. Okay, let's start now. Yeah, let's All day. We'll see you over there. Thanks, Christine. Oh. We'll see you over on the CW. Hey, don't forget <laughs> Artist Fair.